So my name is Beth Bruce Van Conley. My title is sales manager. I work for a company called Superior Asphalt Materials. We're a um, part of our main company, Geneva Construction. I do all of the outside sales for the asphalt and the materials that the asphalt plant produces. Yeah, some people say I did it the hard way. Um, I started in construction working for a concrete company when I was in college and finished my bachelor's degree and worked part-time working for the concrete company. When I started there, I was doing accounts payable, believe it or not, and then just kind of worked my way through the company. And I was with the concrete company for 10 years. And then at that point, I had reached being a manager, office manager at the time. I was handling all of the audits and um, insurance and all of that stuff with the company. And I got an opportunity to transfer over to a different brand to the company into asphalt. In 2018, I got an opportunity to kind of streamline what I was doing and only stick with the sales, the outside sales. But with all of the experience, it gives me a good background on working with the customers and stuff because I thoroughly understand what's going on with the asphalt plants and with the crushers and work well with the guys. I think that the future is limitless. Of course, there's a good majority of women out there that should get involved in our industry and can thrive in our industry. And we just need to get the word out there and we need to get those women involved. And I think the possibilities are endless. I work really hard at trying to reach out to them. I remember what it was like when I first got into construction it was a much different environment than what it is now. And I wish at that point that I would have had more women that would have reached out to me and been like, come here, come with me. Let me help you. Let me show you an easier route. You know, in my beginning years, we fought hard to try and you know, to matter, to be able to go to events, to get out of the office. So if we go to an event and I see that there's new women there that I've never met before or a younger crowd, we try to reach out to them, you know, and try and bring them into the fold and trying to get them to be more comfortable, to realize that, you know, as long as they can relax and, and network and work their way around the room, that there's a lot of people that are in our industry that are willing to help. You just have to reach out to them. We just work really hard just trying to reach out to these women and let them know that it's a safe environment for them to come and work and thrive. And, and there's a lot of support and the people are great. I think my favorite part is just the people. I've met so many wonderful people in our industry. I've gotten such great support. And a lot of the people that I've met in our industry have been friends, great friends, people that are now my best friends. It just grows from there. There's so many wonderful people in the industry that I think that's the best positive takeaway that I can get out of the industry is had there not been so many great people, I probably wouldn't have stayed in the industry. Um, I was slated to actually go and work for the federal government and I got into the industry and never looked back. And most of it is because of the people that I've met along the way. If you have the chance to get involved, get involved in Women of Asphalt. There's so few of us and we need to support the ones that are here and we need to bring in new people. So get involved and help the, the people that are around you, especially the women, because we can't afford to lose any more in our industry.